soldiers. Before I return to my church, I would like to congratulate you personally. These were no more than the scum of the earth. The ones who bit the hands that fed them. Therefore, let this be a lesson to all thieves. Adira. We will bury these miserable ones outside the walls of our church, in unconsecrated ground. For them, there is no salvation, no hope. Let them burn in hell. Viva México! Long live the poor. Well, Irlandes. Padre.
The Americans say that they're lost. Keep it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Bomba. Let them drink. Drink. Now search them. The belt. What's this? Just a piece of paper. Identification paper. Nothing important. Why don't you answer your bell, priest? Read it. I said, read it. What are you doing here? I asked you to read it, priest. This document is a serving officer in the United States Army on official business to the established. Yes, established. Mexican government of President Porfirio Diaz. The Mexican government? They don't like us. They send soldiers here to try to kill us. And you, you do business with them? We do business with everyone. Just want to help. You hear that, priest? The Americans, they just want to help. <laughs> Let me welcome you to Bastardo. Bella, Carmina! Si, sí, Don Carlos. Bomba, you see to our guest. You disapprove, priest. Man. 
And everyone deserves a good woman before he dies, no? <laughs> Only for you, priest, a woman? Or maybe you don't approve of the way Carmina and Perla give the last rites? Hypocrite! Judas! I wish to visit my husband's grave. The coffin is empty. You could have to remove a body without paying for it. I can pay for it. <laughs> Bob, I shot the lady to the cemetery, huh? And that is born of a woman has but a short time to live and is full of misery. In the midst of life, we are in death. We have erred and strayed from thy ways like lost sheep. We have left undone those things we should have done. We should have done if we have done those things which we ought not to have done, and there is no help in us. We therefore commit these bodies to the grave. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Looking for the resurrection of the body when the earth shall give up the dead. Amen. How did he die? I don't remember, Signora. I don't even remember him. It was not so long ago. You want me to dig him up? No. That's not why I came here. So why did the Signora come? To give someone in this town $20,000 in gold. Now, who in this town could be so lucky? I mean, what would he have to do? All he would have to do is say one word. The name of the man who killed my husband. You have the gold with you? I'm not so foolish. The money will only be paid when the body of that man reaches El Paso across the American border. And me with it, alive. Now do you remember who killed my husband? I shall make it my concern. <laughs> uh, bomba! Si. Take the senora to the hotel and see that we... and see that she gets a nice clean room. Thank <laughs> you. 
friend. <laughs> Hello, friend. He is a deaf mute. your good friend, Don Carlos, eh? Come, come, come. Jose, you forgot your bottles. Culebra, Jose has forgotten his bottles. But so terribly hot, eh? Shave nice. So much drink. I bought them. With my share of the money. How much did Jose get? Ten pesos. Where are you down, Carlos? I found it under the table. Up. Up! You're my friends. Why are you doing this to me? Jose, yeah. now you will pay for those drinks. <laughs> Shake him. Please, don't do this to me. Calabra, La Bomba, help me! Shall we have the truth or you want to hang up there until you start stinking? My sister, my puta sister, La Perla. She is the one who gave them to me. I don't steal the money, I tell you the truth. <laughs> now your money is all gone. <laughs> Get La Perla. Oh, 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 oh. I swear to you, I didn't take the money. <laughs> How about you, Angel? Was the hundred dollars in your room? Your dowry, perhaps? I told you, I know nothing about it. This dog who called himself my brother, he put it there. And Bustera! You... Puta! Uh, she puta. took it, I saw her! Let me kill her myself! Please, Colebra, let me down. I'll do anything. Remember that when Carlos returns. No. Oh. Oh. Stop! This animal! I will tear your eyes out! Uh. Hey, amigos! Shall we hang the mother too? Uh. Tell the senora what you told me. I will tell you, Don Carlos. She will not speak even to save my life. But I will tell you. I will tell you everything. Senora, she killed your husband. She liar, stole the money, liar, too! Liar, Let her die! See, si, see! Si. Well, then you can prove it, huh? By killing her. Just push. Please, Don Carlos. Uh, all right, then you please be, eh? 
You kill him. You push him. No, no, please, God, I will. I will do it. Oh, no! Tell me, Jose, how many men have you killed? Ten? Maybe twelve? I don't remember. I only obey orders, Carlo. I always obey orders. I know, Jose. <laughs> and you helped your sister to kill the senor's husband. If you say so, Carlo. I don't want you to say if I say so. Just say yes or no. Did you help to kill him? Yes. I helped. To kill him. Oh. Why, there's the senora satisfied. They hate each other. Now, you want the two bodies, or will just one do for the coffee? Butcher! Murderer! Judas! You promised their lives! If they would tell the lies you wanted. Crazy. Murderers! I know who killed your husband. Aguila! Aguila! Aguila? There's no such person. That woman, she's crazy. Now you have to kill her. First, her gold. I haven't seen any gold, only a coffee. Did you know my husband? I know you. We've never met. But I know you. The old woman said Aguila killed my husband. To be a revolutionary, one must be prepared to be violent. How do you know me, Father? My bad dreams getting worse. What do you dream about me? You have a knife. You come into my room. Put the knife into my back. You know why I'm here. Let your husband rest. How do I rest? Tell me, how? I don't know. Go while you can. When I leave, there will be a body in the coffin that came with me. Be sure it isn't your own. Every other stranger who's come to this town has ended up in the cemetery. Except you. I am the priest. Is he? Are you?
Now do we kill the witch? Huh? You waited too long. Hey, priest! Hey, priest! The senora, she is with you? Yes. You gonna fight for her? I fight for no one. Ah, uh, bueno. Now you open up the door. I said I fight for no one. That was a mistake! Bomb of idiot! I'm still your friend, you hear me, priest? I hear you. Now listen! You have little water, a very little food, few bullets. How long can the senor last, right? Now here's what I'm gonna do. The senor offers $20,000 in gold for a dead man, right? Well, for the same price, very cheap, I'm gonna give her her life. All right? No rush. Just talk to her. In the meantime, we're gonna have a little truce. A little peace, huh? You hear me, priest? Who is Aguila? Aguila is the revolution. Go on. Idiot. You watch. Keep it covered. I thought I told you to stay outside and watch, idiot. Francisco is watching. La bomba the idiot is thirsty. What are you doing now?
¡Señora! ¡Tell la señora who is Águila! ¡Tell her! Águila uh, is... I cannot hear you, Don Carlos. Águila is... Yeah. Whatever happens, you stay here. Stay here. Villanets! Hey, Lantens. Penny Tills. I've been so glad to see you, man, in all my life. Let me kiss you, big man. Good God, why are you dressed like this? You're hiding among man. In a sense, what? Passion makes history. Reason hides from it. Come with me. Put on a good, clean uniform. I'll make you a lieutenant. Come into my army. Two years will be presidents. Ten years will own Mexico. Thank you. No? Is this the last church we liberated? Yes, it was. Don't tell me you got religion, huh? You? The priest killer? Well, well, well. Did you go mad, old friend? Did you ever have a church before? I mean, in Ireland or someplace where we were dead? This is my only church. Well, I got the religion, too. Oh, yes. If you're close to God, you have to love the rich. He likes them better, you see. That's why they always win. That's why I change sides. What are you doing? Mending. Mending. Hey, Landis, old friend. Uh, perhaps you can help me. Well, if I can. Where's Aguilar? Where is Aguilar? I'll never tell you. I said, I'll never tell you. So you are trying to crawl back to God. I would if I knew where to find him. Good friend, brother, comrade, Irishman, Catholic. So far from home, so far from the green of Ireland. I know how to torture you, because I know you. But? But? But I know this would never break you. It would have to be through others. Where is Aguilar? Tell you very simply. You'll never find him through me. No. Then I will hang them 
in order to break you. Men and women, young and old, and you will watch me from your little window, and you will be broken. You may break me, but I'll never tell you. I have no sentimental friend. I have squeezed the last drop of dust from my very bones. So don't count on the good old times, for they were mean and rotten. And I was poor then, old friend. These are the good times. And I am rich. You can join me. You can enjoy or you can suffer. Choose now. But I told you, I've already chosen. So watch me from your little window. Benito. Yes. You're looking older. So do you. It's the mayor, Excellency. So, you're the mayor of this town, huh? To you. So it's not official. No? No. Why not? There was no voting. Nobody voted. Never mind. I, uh... I'm looking for the man who is known as Aguila. I have reason to believe he's here in this town. You are the mayor of this town. Is he here? See, si. On the pole, outside. I caught him for you. <laughs> You're sure he's Aguilar? Sure. I know Aguilar like he was my brother. Sure, he is. Not Carlos, the bandit. <laughs> well, you see, Excellency, I've only been mayor since today. And, and I, they don't. <laughs> How would you like to be whipped 100 lashes, huh? Oh, no. You're the mayor. How do you like to be hung from the gallows like a common peasant? No. Joey Aguilar by tomorrow morning. I will find him. I will find him. Magnifico. Free. Oh, 
only one must die. Aguila. We can all go free. Listen to me. You must listen to me, Paquito. Paquito. Paquito! It is a bad day, Carmina. You pig. Oh. I can get this out of here. The right word for me to the colonel, I mean. Carmina. Carmina. Manuel and Luis, they are watching us because they are jealous. They hate us. You know, all we have to do is say that their father is Aguila. Manuel, Luis, help me and we will go free. All we have to do is to tell the colonel who is Aguila. <laughs> to the colonel. One of you must know who he is. Tie him up. Oh, no. Senor. The colonel has asked me to do him a service. I must find Aguila. I have to find Aguila. How can I find him if I am tied up? Aguila, step forward. He is a coward. He refuses. Then one of you must denounce him. <laughs> Starting tomorrow at seven, five of you will join your male of bomba and be hanged by the neck slowly until dead. The same will happen every four hours until I have Aguila!
Stop! Bring me here. What's your name? A brave man. I like brave men. I need brave men. Would be wise to change masters. Aguila, two respected brave ones. Manuel Sanchez. Manuel Sanchez. Sanchez. Yes, exactly. Bring him here. Now. Tell me what you know of Aguila. I was one of the first to join him over 15 years ago. You would not think to look at me now. But I was a great fighter. Well, one is only to look in your face to know that. At the same time, I was one of his personal advisors. I was a great man. If he had won, there'd be no poor in this country now. Look, I don't care to know what he would have done. Only what you know about him now. Yes, Excellency. You see, planning the uprising was very difficult. The government forces had the spies everywhere. He would not show himself to anyone for fear of being betrayed. He could only trust a few of us. He would ride at night. That's why he was called Aguila. Because like an eagle, he would swoop down and then be gone again. We won four buttons. And then, through a traitor, we were defeated. And I was blinded. We fled to these hills. We all split up and some of us took shelter in this ruined town. I did not meet Aguila again. You've been very patient, old man. But tell me, how do you plan to deliver Aguila into my hands? How do you plan to do that? With this, let my fingers touch the faces of those you suspect. And I will tell you if it is Aguila. The old woman said Aguila killed my husband. The colonel says you knew my husband. Fought with him everywhere. Yet the colonel says he did not know my husband. Tell me what is true. Won't you answer me? You know if you do not, 
I will have the colonel's men drag you from your church and hang you. I'm not finished. Everything is ready, Excellency. Speak, and I will give the order which will free you. midst of life, we are in death. We have erred and strayed from thy ways like lost sheep. We have left undone those things we should have done, and we have done those things which we ought not to have done. And there is no help in us. As he forgives us who trespass against him, Therefore, it is my grace.
patter off the gate and lost his mind. We fired our guns and the British kept it coming. There wasn't as many as there was a while ago. We fired one small and they began to run down the Mississippi to the Gulf of Mexico. I would do it all over again if I had the chance. It was worth it. So you really lived, eh, Paco? Yes, I lived. Maybe that's all your life's worth, three nights in El Paso. So, now I must die because I live for three nights. We gave you money to buy guns, not wine and whores. You're a murderer and you're a thief. They steal from me my whole life. I only steal three days.
please. I've come to see the general. You are late, musician. I am not truly a musician. No. You look more like a bandit. Only one week ago, I am an officer in the People's Army. What is the People's Army? Uh, the Revolution. Oh. So you came here for us to shoot you? Shoot him? No. I think you make big mistake if you kill me before I speak with the general. The general doesn't speak to scum. I think he will when he learns what I have come to talk about. This man says he can deliver Aguila for reward. All right, Captain. Take care of it. He says he will only talk to you, Excellency. Pay him his money, Captain, and get all the information. Yes, sir. Come on. No! It is very important information. I tell it only to the General. Tell him I will listen. If the general will look at me. I am, after all, not a cockroach. I am a man like other men. Aguila is a man too. The best one I ever know, but he cannot help me now. No one can. <laughs> to be poor in Mexico is to be dead. Aguila, where is he? Answer the general. If he will look at me. Excellency, let me take this one outside. I will shoot him through the middle, so he'll take a long time dying. Then he'll tell us about Aguila. Go on, Captain. Take me. Shoot me. Go on. Leave us. Now, where will I find Aguila? I will pay you the money. You don't have to find him. He's coming here tonight. The raid is planned for many weeks for the night of your fiesta. He needs your guns and money for more guns. He will be here tonight.
into the Pueblo. Get in there alive. I'll go back. Which way did they go, eh? You know! You know which way they'd go. Federalists are after us. Still don't believe it. It's too hard to believe. But then I never heard of Aguila till we parted company. That's when the legend began, yes. No wonder no one could find him. There never was an Aguila. It was you, all the time, saying you were riding with him. What an Irish trick. I'd have to take you to Mexico City. You'd be tried and shot. Even if you died here, I'd still have to take your body there. Those are my orders, dead or alive. I have to do that, you know. Oh, if only we could have gone to Mexico City and, and dined and drank and had women and celebrated. If only we could. Listen, why don't you just confess? Let's get it over with here and now, huh? Why do you need a confession? 
Because I have a conscience. Then I confess everything, and I deny nothing. You sent for me? No, I ordered you. Here is Agana. Did he confess? He has not denied it. I don't believe you. <laughs> believe me? <laughs> you do not believe me? So now I'm a liar? You are a fool. Get out! Will you release the other prisoners? Not yet, but you have Aguilar. By the way. How could you be sure? I tended him when he had a head wound. I touched his face many times. I am sure, Senora. I am sure. There were two of them, Papa. Two? Aguilar and his friend. How do you know the wounded man was Aguilar? Papa can only be half wrong. If the priest is not Aguila, then he has to be the other man. The friend. My father is very sick. He will die. I have to take him inside. Por favor, señor. Please help us.
Sanctuary, please. There's no such thing. Yes, I remember. You're right. We are older. One man can bear grief on this. It takes two to be happy. If we win, you can still put on my uniform. If we win, you can put on my robe. I wonder what's going on out there. You go and look, Colonel. <laughs> no, no, I, uh, I like it much better here. It's cooler. Shall we be punished for our sins? By them. Shall we repent them? They say it's easier to repent of those sins you've already committed than of those you intend to commit. If we have one, I intend to commit a great many. Yes. It's over. Shall we bet? On what? Our souls. I don't like the odds. your husband couldn't have gone on couldn't fight anymore who killed him the man was crippled he could have come back to me that was not what he wanted let the living die he said so that the dead can live how do you know what he wanted Loved me. He loved the people. Let my body die, he said, so that my spirit can live. He pulled himself up onto his knees. He put his pistol into my hand. He shouted, Viva! Pull 
pulled that pistol against his brain. He begged me, fire it. Let my name go on like the eagle, he said. Let every rich man in Mexico wake up screaming when the poor cry, Idola, Idola, Idola. So I pulled the trigger with his own hand on mine. The terrible thing is that since I did it for him, it's all seemed to me quite useless. And I too had ideals. Since I killed him, I've lost them. I've no longer been concerned with the just nor the free. But simply and solely with this, just wanted to mend this. This was all that I have been able to compass. Murderer. Yes! The devil always wants to play God. The devil has the largest congregation 